Okay, so hey everyone and welcome back to my channel. Give me two seconds to go close my door. <laughs> two minutes. Boom, 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 and we're back. So I've closed my door and I'm gonna put my mirror down for a second. Excuse me. <laughs> because um, this is actually the first video that I'm really excited to film because I don't think I've filmed, apart from one video, this January and I was so determined like I'm gonna go on a complete detour here but I was so determined this year to like really get into YouTube really film really do everything and my camera just this camera that I'm currently filming on I couldn't work out like what to do on it like how to use it and I got really really frustrated I had a complete block after like such a motivation to be on such a block I was like oh my god my life is over if that makes any sense to any of you guys. Um, but I'm now out of that rut. I've worked out clearly how to focus this camera and I'm so ready to film. So be prepared because from now on, I'm actually gonna have some content out. Yes, go me. And yes, I'm gonna undo my hair because it's really annoying me. I look like some kind of SpongeBob. SpongeBob, not SpongeBob. What's like an egghead? I'm an egghead. So yeah, it is currently dark outside and I'm going to film this video. So it is going to be something to do with makeup. I don't know what's going to go on my eyes, but it will be in the title. <laughs> so that's the best part. Um, so yeah, I'm going to do stuff on my eyes and my lips and I'm going to show you guys and just do a chatty video. And in case you guys haven't clocked it already, I'm in a new background, actually an old background. If you guys have been here for a while. I want to say, when did I start this channel? 2014? 2014, you will know, I used to film with this background facing this way. So like, the light would come in from my window. But now, because of good old artificial lighting, I don't have to worry about that. And I've just made a two minute, 19 seconds intro. <laughs> yeah! Quality content. So I'm gonna go into my lovely Alex drawers at the side of me and get a eyeshadow palette out and do my eyes for you guys. Um, this lighting is gonna annoy me, so I'm just gonna move it up. Okay, okay. This is gonna be the year when you guys realise you've subscribed to an absolute freak, so be ready. Um, that's a better angle. Okay, I'm illuminated. Oh, I'm such a weirdo. Right, um, I'm gonna use this palette actually which is, ooh, <laughs> which was a Christmas present off one of my best friends. This is the Zoeva Caramel Melange, M Melange, a caramel palette, okay? Um, yeah. Oh my gosh, I didn't even realise it had, like, stuff on the back. Okay. But yeah, it looks like this, and um, I've only just decided to use it because I didn't plan this video. I'm just sat here filming. <laughs> Yay! So, right, let's do this. Oh, and my brush is on this side. <laughs> Fabulous. I'm going to take these brushes, see? Beauty. And I'm going to pop them in my Alex drawer. Like, are you ready? Are you ready for this? Quality YouTuber content! A. So, they're going to sit there so I can reach into them and blend my eyeshadow. Oh, see, it's just the skills you need. I'm going to use a smaller mirror because I know that's going to annoy me. Right. I'm going to use the small NARS mirror because, you know, I'm wrong. Oh my god, my skin. I'm not even going to go there. Right. I'm going to take this shade called Wax Paper. What a weird shade name. And get it all over my brush, like so. Beauty Guru goals. Tap it off. And set all of my eye. Man, my skin looks like a caked up mess. I basically tried to use a combination of foundations to see if I could like the Urban Decay foundation. I did a review on this channel and um, I can tell, I love it, this combination that I've done on my cheeks but on my forehead, like where I'm dry, because of that Urban Decay foundation in it, like I can see, oh, so much dryness. And I've kept this on all day, and it's like melted off of my nose, and like I'm dry skinned, I'm not oily. So, yeah, I'm just gonna ignore how my skin looks right now. <laughs> okay, so back on to this eyeshadow look. I'm just gonna take this out because it's gonna warm me. Right, uh, 
don't fall over. I'm going to use the next shade over called Universal Delight as um, a transition shade, as people like to call it. Wow. Buff that. I don't know what you call this motion. Like, put it into my eye sockets, okay? I don't know how to call it that. I'm going to go in with this orangey shade called Aftertaste. You look intriguing and pigmented on a small pointy-ish one. I don't know what I'm doing. I'm ringing this entire process. It's like a poppy kind of colour. Well, I say poppy, I mean like the Makeup Geek shadow poppy, like that's what I imagine it to look like. I'm gonna go in with the shade Alchemy, which is this fat shade. Ooh, girl. On this brush, I think. I'm trying to keep those like peachy tones in it while slightly making it a bit more brown. I don't know how I'm describing this, but okay. I'm going to go in the shade 182 degrees Celsius or centigrade. I don't know. I'm not American. Hello. Oh. Right, that's very orange. So now I'm going to add back some brown. I'm going to use this brush and go into the shade Finish Central. Okay. What do you say, my friend? It just looks to be like a brown. I'm going to use this teeny tiny little brush on the matte white shade. I kind of want it to be shimmery but then I don't want to dip into another palette because that's taking the mick. So, I'm going to just add that to, no you know what, I don't like the fact that it's matte. No, I need like a shimmer. I'm going to take Where's my foundation? Okay, so I'm going to take the same highlight that is on my cheekbones right now. It is this Sleek Face Form Contouring and Blush Palette in the shade Light 373, the middle one. You can tell it's the highlight shade because it's the highlight shade. Because I'm that good. Right. I'm going to put that in the inner corners. Oh, this eye. I might take the shade Liquid Center, which looks like this. Oh, excuse me. <gasps> I'm gonna just pack that like kind of in the center. I know I said I didn't want to dip into the palette, but I really, really do. Um, because I really want that like, bright under, like inner, like there <laughs> is how I'm gonna call it. I'm gonna take my Morty, 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 Morphe, that's like O, this brush here to dip into this shade, no, this shade here. It's one of my faves and it actually fell out when I was on holiday and I've um, sellotaped it back in because I like it so much. <laughs> Ratchet. Okay. So I'm going to take that, just, oh yes, mama, work over where I put those highlight, the, the highlight bit, that will do, okay, fairly low still, right, I'm going to try and find a lip colour that I want to pair with this, um, I don't know what I want to do. Do I want to do a nude? Do, 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 do. That's three different colours. Um, might do like an ombre nude if I can find my toffee. I'm going to go with toffee. Okay. I'm going to see if I like the way these two look together with this eye. Because it does kind of like speak for itself. So I'm going to use the Primark Lip Liner in Toffee. By the way, this is actually my favourite lip combo at the minute. However, my lips are really dry, so I don't know whether it will work. But...
I basically line my lips with this, fill half of it in to about the inner bit so it's more pouty and then I put the liquid lipstick on top of all of it. So yeah, this was the finished look. I hope you guys enjoyed it. It was kind of a chatty get ready with me, kind of halfway from ratchet to more ratchet. <laughs> so yeah, this is the first video back in ages. I really hope you guys enjoyed it and I'll see you guys in next week, next weeks, next days, next whatever video. Bye. <laughs> Bye guys.